want some that's 30 percent i want 30 percent cover on that one because we uh, just couldn't buy a county or, or... <laughs> So what do we got here? Some, Joel measures this is the CRP lines? cut. We actually chopped the slide. I think there's 30 percent there. And this is the CRP soil without the cover. It's actually pulverized. And actually, you'd be amazed if you did this work. Including the conventional till no cover. Conventional till 30 oh, percent. Conventional 90, 95 percent. Right. We don't have a I got everybody's attention here. Um, what we what we've got. I'm going to explain to you what we've got, and you can tell me if you want me to to change the the um, the orientation of any of this. I guess we can pull part of this back. The three soils in these three trays are a highly tilled soil. Conventional tillage, poster child for conventional tillage in back of county. The two trays on the other side, the one with the cover on it, is a is a cut out of the CRP field that fits right down into the tray just like it was, was planted. The soil next to it is the soil right next to that cut, but we've taken all the cover off of it so it's a bare soil. This soil, the till soil here, will be bare. It'll be exposed to the rain without any cover at all. This tray is supposed to represent about 30% cover. I think Dr. Sutherland's probably a little strong there. I think he's probably more 35 to 40, but. That's, that's okay. This would represent. Everybody's a critic. <laughs> this would represent 95, probably 95 percent cover. There's a little bit of it that's exposed, not too much. Now, our 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 nozzle, our nozzle comes out here. It's going to spray all. The thing I liked about the one in uh, in Wallace that we saw in Wallace, Nebraska, was that it went back and forth. And it provides some some visual stimulation for people. Yeah. But. This one just this one just sprays right <laughs> down. Storm. This actually puts out water faster than the other one did because it's raining on everything all the time. Rain does this simulate? I mean, just as if I, I, I mean, inches per hour, or just if, if that's a measurement that you use. Or... Just a lot of water on the soil. Yeah. Okay. So uh, what time. what it did yesterday? We did about How two much? and a quarter inches in about two four minutes. Quarter. Okay. So it's Which, a pretty heavy rain. Heavy, heavy so that'd be a dark your, heavy rain. Yeah. Your, your slope you, here actually is a little bit extreme. Four. Most of our soils in Bacca County anyway probably would be 1%, 2% at the most. These, these are probably quite a bit higher than that. But we're setting it up for the extreme to show right, as it's a, a demonstration. demonstration. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> now we actually do have, you see we're getting a big area wet here. We actually do have, when we... When we go inside with this, we have a little hood that will actually clamp on the top. We didn't bring it today. You're at nine, nine pounds. Probably want to go six down pounds. Uh, oh, five five. Five. Four. That's five. five. Four. You got a four? Anybody? Anybody? <laughs> I think say it's five. Say it five. Yeah. There again, <laughs> Tim gets the final one. Say it. He always does. <laughs> It'll take a little bit for this to soak up, but what, what we want you to do is pay attention to what's happening in in the jars, and we'll want to try to we'll want to try to see what we got in the way of rain. This actually didn't work out quite the way we had envisioned it yesterday when we did it. Uh, the the results as far as the infiltration were right, but some of the other stuff we'll show you here in a minute wasn't. Now you'll notice in that center tray now we're starting to get a little shininess on that, where uh, right. where it's taking in the moisture. But if you look at the one bear next to it, you're not seeing that shining. Like you're already, getting, you're already getting all the way through on them, right? That was already saturated soil, yeah. wasn't it? But it did that almost that fast yesterday when it was yeah, bone dry. Yeah, it, it, it was bone dry. Well, and it, but, well, I think that that's an interesting thing though because. That was already saturated, so you would think that you wouldn't have any protection. Mm. Well, it wasn't saturated, but well, it was field right. Yeah, it would have right. been field capacity, not saturation. But it's, but it's right, well, you know. Yeah. Technically, it'd been rained on twice by Mother Nature. You got it by by coming through on the far <laughs> left, <laughs> too. Coming through the draw. Now, if you, notice, if you notice in the center one, you're starting to get some splash, some yeah. dislocation of one of the soil particles. We didn't see any of that yet. No, we didn't. CRP took it all. But we are putting a lot of rain on here, you know, yeah. in short periods. 
Yeah, you already got what an inch in there. Yeah, and you got there. some runoff on the middle. The right hand side is what you're oh, okay. looking at. Okay. I think it's three quarters three of an inch or something like that. Yeah. We're only about three minutes into this, this too. On the yeah, that's uh, kind of amazing already. That, it's a little early to really be quantitative with it, but it's kind of amazing to me that you've got not a whole lot more runoff on the bare ground that's still than you do on the on the 30 percent ground, and 30 percent is where the USDA hangs its hat. I was probably negotiating. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of these negotiations <laughs> 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 I think we're still getting some infiltration in that. I think we've got some piping going on. It may be. It's been four minutes. It may be that the, the intake rate on this particular soil, this should be a WIB soil, and uh, it may be that the infiltration rate is a little higher than what we saw. Now, there is a little bit of runoff happening over here on the uh, the one that's totally covered, but you don't see very much soil in it. It's pretty clean. What's amazing to me is the one that you took the brick to and broke it up. There's nothing. There's well, nothing. It's, it's behaving really well. That's yeah, what I'm saying. You don't have to. We saw that yesterday. It's amazing. Not running off. I could imagine that CRP no, dirt without the cover could behave right. basically like most of just that. That's amazing. That's amazing. That's amazing. That's amazing. That's amazing. Ed, you got it coming through. Did you guys take it yeah, on the I third? Yeah, it's been off. five minutes. Okay. We're not quite five minutes. I was gonna, I was gonna warn you on that. Uh, okay. I think we could. Ten seconds we, away here. If we had some, not box count. I think it's five, right. five minutes now. Yeah, five. Somewhere. Had, you know, we had some quads and stuff on top, you know, the little quads I showed you how soft they were, all those have really kind of melted out. But look at look at the soil stability, the aggregate stability on this soil, of course you can't see it on that one. We, know that. we already know it's We know that's wet. Right. It's going to be Nobody's pure mud. Look at that, right? It's good. Well, I wanted to. The camera people need to the see it. The camera people need to see it. All right, one for the cameras. Might not tap that with your rubber mallet just a little bit. There you go. Uh oh. Yeah, that part's pretty stiff. Yeah, I need it. There you go. Nice, nice. Yeah, so that's what we expected. To that's see. good. Yeah, a lot of fine roots in that. Next one's CRP pulverized. CRP, CRP pulverized. pulverized. I'm Not you, pulverized, this is what but he, no, he pulverized, pulverized it fit. with bricks. We're he talking took about this right here, took bricks. the top of it and yeah. pulverized it. I was going, why are you doing that? Yeah. <laughs> we need a tear. It's going to be a little bit of variability here, but look at that. Okay, we got we got okay. most of it saturated. Okay. I think that was part of our time function. Yes. That's now pretty this quick. is five this minute range. This is conventional, flip, flip. right? Half. This is totally conventional. This is kind of wow. where you take the wand on the, the little black hat before the rabbit comes out. <laughs> That's what that about. Look at that. Yeah. Now, how far down? Now we got some on the end. We got some running down. Mm -hmm. But look how far. How far that came in. And you got an inch of runoff in the tub. Right. The front tub. It was running off. And soil, it was taking soil with it. Right. So we're going to so, get the same or better or worse? Uh, probably Scott, not a whole lot. We were talking but about maybe on the way a little better. Okay. It's a little bit better probably than the first one, but we still got quite not a, a whole bit of soil on the yeah. bottom. But we're we're almost all the way to the bottom. If you look, if you look right in here, we've almost percolated all the way down. So it, it helped a little bit by having some. Yeah, right there you can that, see that's that. That's con conventionally farmed. Absolutely down there. conventionally farmed. 30, 30, big time. 30%. Big time. Oh, One yeah. time a spray he, pilot got off course, but the rest of the time it's all yeah. <laughs> plow, baby plow. He he believes in it. Yeah. yeah. The, last the one last thing on this, and yeah, this is what this dad. is what struck me in Wallace so that this 30 percent residue cover on conventionally tilled soil didn't really behave oh, yeah. here as good as what I expected. Oh. Okay, again we didn't get maybe completely soaked up. Timing is kind of an yeah, issue. This this has some 
some um, probably some water intake things on this particular soil. We'll probably try a backup next time. But we did get almost all the way through it, and this is the same soil. Same so, treatments, except same for the, treatments. The cover. I mean, it came out of the same, basically the same hole. So the difference in what you see here and what you see on that one is just the cover and being cover. able to intercept the, the energy force of the raindrops.